The next one is friendship. Friendship is vital to intimacy and developed by spending time together. Look at Solomon 5.16. It says, Such a woman of Jerusalem is my lover, my friend. And what I love about that is it's expressing the fact that he's not just her lover, but he's her friend as well. And for many of us, we separate the two. And then we wonder why we're not close together. We, only, we spend all of our time on the physical side, but we don't do anything together to become friends. So here's some things to do. The first thing is take an interest in your spouse's interests so that you know him or her better than anybody else. Do you really know what your spouse is interested in? You can say, yeah, he's interested in sports. Great. Do you know his favorite team? Of course I do. He's got the hat, the jacket, the underwear, the socks. Okay? That's a given. Okay? Can you name six players on the team? Yeah, a little harder. Do you know what place the team finished last year? Hmm, don't know. Do you know the next time? You see what I'm saying? Understand those things. Guys on the other side, right? Do you know what your wife is interested in? If it's interior decorating, go around long and pick colors. All right? Do something. But whatever it is, whatever those interests are, do you know them better than anybody else does with your spouse? Some people don't even know their spouse's interests. They just assume it's what they're interested in. 